Now, you have to have a bit of a wry smile, don't you, about our national broadcaster at times. Television stations, especially ones like this one that produce a lot of live content with a limited resources, we have our share of mistakes and bloopers. But the ABC has more than 4,000 staff on an average wage of more than $100,000 a year and a taxpayer-funded budget of more than a billion dollars a year. Yet they still seem to make many mistakes. They have so many stuff-ups. Well, after four days back at work, our Polly's are now on a well-deserved two-week break. <laughs> but uh, what a four days it was, as we all know. Parliament opened on the Monday, and like the Overlook Hotel in The Shining during the off-season, <laughs> was occupied mainly by madmen, ghosts and the odd woman trying to keep it all together. <laughs> Talk about keeping it all together, that was last night's episode of Mad as Hell. But it transpires it also happened to be last week's episode. The ABC accidentally put a repeat to air, angering regular viewers and even making Mad as Hell's host, Sean McAuliffe, mad as hell on Twitter. Oh, well, never mind. Perhaps there's a clue in all this for ITA. They could run everything twice and cut their budget by half.